Hello YouTubers, it's Bill. Today is Saturday the 4th of, uh, 4th of April, 2009, and I'm here at the baseball game, and I'm making tacos. So the first step is uh, chop five small onions, and then brown them uh, in a little bit of corn oil until they're, you know, brown. -ish. Yeah, I don't know much about the baseball game, but I know that was a caught fly, infield fly rule. But I do know that you have to brown the onions as much as you'd like them brown before you put the meat in. I'll do that. Well, that looks about right. That's about brown enough. There goes the marshal. Hopefully we're going to throw me out. But I'm good. So they're brown. Now time to add the meat. The meat I got is this pure ground beef. None of that not pure ground beef. I'm sure it's mostly fat, but that's what I want here for tacos. So you slice down the side of the chub. That's what they call this thing. And then you just... I do know I've got two chubs in there. I'll start browning that meat. So what you'll see is you get a lot of uh, beef fat on top. Now, the, the, a good cook will spoon that off. I won't be doing that. Okay. Next, we're going to add the taco seasoning sauce. This is enough for one for four pounds of meat. I bought four of them, even though we have six pounds of meat. In that this is in Chicago, we're going to add a Chicago Cubs beer to the mix. So once the beer is in and starts to cook, then we'll add this. This is my secret ingredient, a little flour and cornstarch. So we're doing well. So far we've got the, uh, the meat and the onions, the beer and the uh, flour and cornstarch. Now we're gonna add a little bit of diced tomatoes. I took the, the, I took the opportunity to open and drain these at home. Next comes the frijoles negros, or the black beans. They add a little bit of character to the tacos. What's on the And lastly, for a little bit of color and to know when the tacos are done going through your system, we've got a tracer element called whole kernel corn. Shows up in the poop later. Yum! After a while, you get this layer of uh, liquid fat on top, and once again, it's important to remove that. Now that's what I'd like. I'd like it with the crunchy taco shells and the meat fill in there, and that's good. But the boys want the soft taco shells, so I gotta make that. I'm sure you got connections. So what you're saying is that I just missed I Eric think, making I a catch so. in uh, right field. You can get him in the post game. He's recording us. You know, I'm sure we are recording all of us. All of us. For, uh, for posterity. That's up to you. NSA. Okay, the taco meat is done. So now the next step is to cook the corn tortillas to make them into taco shells. This is gonna be the hard part of the day, I think. The secret to doing this right is to have the oil ready when you put the tortilla in. Put the tortilla in, submerse it, let it cook real quickly, flip it over, cook it some more, and haul it out. Let me see if I can do this one-handed. Uh-oh, Eric's up to bat. Okay, run, flip it over, flip it over, fold it in half, hold it down, pick it out, and it's done. So this is the team, and they're having tacos. Well, not you yet, but you will. <laughs> they're having tacos, and uh, how are the tacos, guys? Perfect. Uh, of course, I'm going to say that. This is going on YouTube tonight. All right.